Good afternoon. Good afternoon, ma'am. What is your full name? My full name is Simran Sharma. Where are you from? I am from Patiala. It is a small city in Punjab. What is the weather like in your hometown? Uh, actually, in my hometown, it's kind of a mixed weather. We have hot weather as well as a cold weather. Hot weather stays for like six to seven months, uh, especially from April to mid November. And cold weather stays from like mid November to mid March. Do you have a favorite season? Yes, I have a favorite season. It's actually a winter season. I really love to enjoy winter in winter clothes, and I love this season not because of just winter clothes, but also the outdoor activities. I love to do cycling in the fresh and cold air. How often do you check the weather, and why? Actually, I don't really check the weather. Uh, like once in a year, maybe when I have to go for an urgent work and I want to be sure that it's not a rainy season or it's not a rainy day, that's the time when I check the weather. Have your plans ever been affected by the weather? Yes, once I, uh, there was a situation when my plans uh, had been affected by the weather. It's actually when I had to go for the exam mm -hmm. and it was raining badly and that's the time when I was not in a good mood because I couldn't reach there in time. Okay, let's talk about snacks. Do you like snacks? Yes, I love snacks as every Indian. Uh, actually, my favorite snack is uh, Lay's and I really, I really love to eat it. Okay, what time of the day do you prefer to have snacks and why? Actually, I don't have a time preference because snacks is something that I really enjoy. Uh, even if it's a morning, afternoon or in the night, I, whenever I have a time and whenever I'm watching some kind of a movie and I'm really interested in the movie, I'm into the movie, that's the time when I just want to have a snacks in front of me. Okay. Do you think snacking is a healthy habit? Uh, no, I do not think so that uh, snacks is a healthy eating habit, mm -hmm. but it's good for some time, like for some days when you are feeling low and when you are feeling like you are with somebody and you are watching the movie and you want to eat something good. Uh, that's the time when you can have a snack, but uh, all uh, overall it's not a good healthy option. Let's talk about puzzles. Do you like word or number puzzles and why? Uh, actually, I like uh, word puzzles more than the number puzzles because I'm not good in numbers. I'm not good in math So I always prefer to have a word puzzle It also enhanced my vocabulary and it also enhanced my confidence that I know the certain type of words and I can learn Better words with the word puzzle. Did you do puzzles as a child? Uh, no, I was not a smart kid not an intelligent kid So I never had a word puzzle But I did a picture puzzle once because my parents gifted it to me on my I think um, ninth or maybe tenth birthday. So that's the time when I uh, enjoyed the picture puzzle. Who do you think does puzzles more? Children or adults? Um, I do think so that children are the one uh, who do the puzzle more because they are in the age when they have to develop their mind, they have to develop their problem solving skills. So uh, if I talk about the adults, they don't have that much time to play the puzzle game. They can, uh, they do play the Sudoku uh, in the newspaper, but most of the children are the ones in the category who play the puzzle. Would you bring a puzzle with you when you travel? No, I would not bring a puzzle with me when I travel because I do not think so that I would want to uh, focus on a puzzle game because it needs uh, the energy and the time. It needs the focus and concentration. I think holidays are the one when you want to enjoy. So I do not think so that I would ever prefer to bring a puzzle with me in the holiday. All right, this is the end of part one. Now in part two, I will give you a cue card. You will have one minute to prepare and you have to speak for one to two minutes. Okay, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I'm ready with my ideas, ma'am. Can I okay. start? Okay. Okay. Uh, actually, I'm not a kind of a person who likes to do outdoor activities. I'm into my home zone. Like I really like to spend a lot of time with my family and with my phone, uh, watching the TV. Uh, so recently, I did the activity because my mother pressured me that I should just go outside and experience some new things. Uh, as I was also not gaining a lot of weight, I'm very skinny. So my mother just uh, having the 
कंसर्न अबाउट मी दैट आई शुड गेन सम वेट बिकॉज इन माई एज लाइक आई एम ट्वेंटी फाइव ईयर्स सो इन माई एज आई शुड इट लीस्ट हैव फिफ्टी और सिक्सटी के जीज ऑफ वेट सो शी रिकमेंडेड मी दैट आई शुड डू द योगा एक्टिविटी कपल ऑफ डेज बैक देर वॉज अ योगा कैम्प ऑर्गेनाइज नियर टू माई हाउस इन द पार्क सो माई मदर एंड आई वेंट देअ इट वॉज अ वेरी नाइस एंड वेरी ग्लूमी डे and there were like couple of uh, females over there who were practicing and we bring we brought the uh, yoga mat with us and uh, we started doing the yoga with the help of an instructor over there and we did some couple of asanas and we also learned how to do meditation while doing the yoga like how to breathe in and breathe out kind of a act, uh, exercise it was a very nice experience i enjoyed it because uh, i was with my mother and it was uh, having a me time with my family also with my mother because after having a long uh, after couple of months like i had such a good time with my mother doing such a good activity uh this activity uh we did it like for an half an hour like in the morning from 6:30 to 7 and after doing this activity uh there was like instructor told us that you have to explain your experience in a one sentence or in a one word so when my turn came uh i really said that i want to pursue this thing i want to do this activity on a regular basis because it was a good experience and uh first thing that i liked about this activity is that it relaxes my mind it really empowers me it really relaxes my mind it motivated me to do more and at the end my mother also was really impressed that at least i liked something because i am a kind of a person who just don't uh, really like the things in a first go so it was a nice experience in the uh, having doing this uh, activity with my mother that's it all right yes. can i have paper pencil yes ma'am Now in part three, let's discuss this topic. What do people in your country like to do when they go out? Actually, there are a couple of things which people like to do uh, when they go out. Uh, if i talk about the generations like young generation really like to uh, have a fun time they like to watch uh, movies when they go out they have want to have some uh, conversation with their uh, friends so they always prefer to go to the restaurants where when it comes to the older generation they really prefer to uh, go for a walk in the evening or in the morning with their neighbors or with their friends uh, in the park okay is it good to go out Yes I do think so that it is good to go out because uh, a person learns so many things when they interact with other people and it only uh, it can only be possible when they uh, step out from their comfort zone Between adults and young who goes out more I do think so that adults are the one who go out more because uh, no matter how they feel they have to go out for the work they have to go out for the shopping for the grocery things they have so many work in their household like chores so they have to uh, go outside to do a lot of things so I do think so that adults are the one Do people consider pollution when doing outdoor activities? No, I do not think so that young people ever consider about the pollution because they don't have that uh, mindset about uh, like having uh, concerns about the environment or the pollution. They just want to have fun. They don't think that even I can give you an example uh, when they st- uh, are standing at the traffic light, they don't even bother to switch off their uh, motor bikes or scooters. So I do not think so that they are ever concerned about this topic. Why do you think people do risky behaviors or dangerous sports? Uh, I think so that people do this kind of activities because they want to have experience they want to have some adventure in their life and uh, they want to just have a fun in their life so that they can uh, tell the stories to their uh, kids or their parents or their friends so i do think so that these are the reasons why they do this kind of activity does being a parent reduce chances of taking risk Uh, yes i do think so uh, that being a parent uh, is something that uh, every parent have some concerns have some uh, have some concerns about their uh, kids so i do think so that this is the phase when parents think that they always want to support their children but they are always concerned about the activities also because they think that uh, 
they might get in danger they might get uh, they might hurt themselves so they are always being in the risky sport all right this is the end of your speaking test thank you well done there were few mistakes in cue card like you said it was nice and gloomy day yes so it cannot be nice and gloomy yes. and then when you were talking about the outdoor activity you did you said it relaxes you it relaxed you because you yes. did that activity yes. otherwise overall it was very good speaking test Thank you. and for this kind of speaking you can score 7 to 7.5 by in real exam thank you ma'am thank you